Um, we'll increase his max HP. He's pretty close to maxed out already. If I remember right. You know, like all this, like, conditional stuff. Um, maybe his attack power here? Maybe that's useful. What was this other one? Yeah. And then some good stuff here. Chain link, I guess, is good. Guess we'll do that one. Anything good from Shulk here? Nothing that really stands out. Um, maybe this one reduces aggro, because I don't want him to actually get too much aggro. Counterattack, agility. Give him some agility. Increases ether when HP is at half. I guess that's useful. Was there something else? No, it's only two points anyway. Uh, HP from healing arts. Block rate. We'll do that one. And strength during the night. He doesn't have like a, too many auras. That's why I keep on avoiding that one. What's this one? Movement speed and weight reduction, I guess. And that one, I guess. Okay, Melia, last one here. No, wrong button. That one can go. No. Those are good. That one can go. No. Yeah, that that's gonna be really nice on her because she she spams the talent art. Uh, physical damage taken down. Movement speed. Increases damage of critical hits, reduces ether damage taken. That sounds good. Weight reduces physical damage taken. Reduces aggro drawn when dealing damage. That's going to be useful for her. No. I saw I had another one of these. I guess that's useful, but we'll see how much I have when I'm done. Nope, a lot of these are just kind of buffs that have lots of conditions on them, and I just don't care that much about that. I want something that happens all the time. That's useful as well. We'll see. That's also useful. No. No. See, now we're like, we're seeing the same ones over and over again and none of them are particularly useful for me. Debuff resistance is actually gonna be pretty good. We'll put that on, what do we have here? Strength isn't gonna be so useful for Melia. Cooldown at night is useful, but I think she's already got that one, yeah. Okay, so then there was 
One that was pretty expensive that was going to be good for her. Let's see if I can find it. No. Where was that one? Maybe it was this one. Close party gauge when activating an aura. She doesn't really use auras. Where was it? It was one of these bottom ones, wasn't it? Reduces physical damage taken. I'll just take that. Um, and then Shulk had one that was pretty good at high levels. Oh, the stat debuff, right. No, I think that one's more useful for me, the one that I have on. Sure, healing arts restore more HP. Plus weight on the equipment still. Increases ether when HP is at half. All right, that is good. Let's head into like all of this to try to get stuff set up for the final fight, right? Uh, we have haste maxed out, strength up maxed out. Uh, do I have anything better than the Monado? No, there's not gonna be anything better than the Monado three. Doesn't matter what else there is. All right, rank it. Let's see what we got. Um, I have everything basically maxed out already. Um, debuff resist is useful. Uh, I don't think there's a spike unless I topple, so we'll just not topple here. Um, agility's already maxed. We'll do uh, night vision. I should have some night vision. Oh, it's only on that. Um, I can get rid of the hastes and put night vision there. There we go. Night vision maxed out. Um, what else do I want to do? I want to put something on. Light lightning attack. That'd be good. Sure. Let's give him lightning attack. Then we'll put... Haste. No, haste has got to go on the weapon. That changes things. Um, we'll still keep night vision on, though. Haste there. And... Haste there. That maxes that out. Then we'll put... Like, I don't need to have the best party, I don't think. Just have to have a good party. Where's all my strengths? Do, do I not have more strengths? At that low level, did I get rid of all of them? That's entirely possible. I have so many strengths. Okay, and he's got one more? Um, we'll give him some defense up, maybe. Uh, physical defense, I think, will be best. Where is my physical defense? I thought that was red. I think muscle up is already maxed out. Physical protect, right? Reduces physical damage by 45%, but only for a little bit. Um, trying to think what else I could need for him. Right, everything's kind of maxed out already. Unbeatable? What does that do again? Oh. No. Rival HP is not going to help me. Buff time plus. Sure. Let's put that on him. Okay. So that's Shulk. Uh, oh, yes. Sharla. Uh, so I got her uh, Heat Sink 6. I got that from grinding on Ancient Dedala. Didn't take too long, luckily. Um, that worked out pretty quickly. I was able to get all three that I wanted. Looks to me like uh, Endless Rifle is the best here. 
because I don't really care about critical rate. Okay, so that's going to be the best one there. So let's give her that heat sink again. Yeah, I need that for the fight against uh, the Ancient Daedala, right? So yeah, you only need one, uh, but uh, I'm going to put two on anyway. Max it out at 75%. Uh, we'll put something good. I don't know. Is there an aggro down? Isn't that blue? Arts heal? Maybe arts heal. She'll heal herself as she attacks. Yeah, using arts recovers 75 HP. It's not much, but... You know, it could be the difference at the end of it. Ether up. Is already maxed out. Let's max out Ether Defense. Um, and then... Uh, I don't know. What do we need right now? Recovery up. Sure, she'll heal herself for a lot more. There we go. That works for me. And then, uh, Ryan, we're going to have to change. We're going to have to change a few things. Uh, Rigel Hand, I think, is good, but, uh, the, like, all this stuff, I was just giving him to have something on him. Days Resist is not 100% necessary. Neither is HP up or Ether up. Spike Defense would have been good. Um... Give him the Rafaga gear, I guess. I think that looks better on him. The Hyrax top can go. I just needed something on him once again. Uh, debuff resist is actually really nice there. Um, we'll just throw that on him. Lancelot gauntlets. Because once again, we're mo mostly dealing with physical defense here. So that gives him haste. That's not bad. Uh, Titan Greaves should probably go. Good footing is not what I need. Wait, what is he got? Like, why is this so much better across the board? Lancelot leggings might be the best for him? That sucks. Um, we'll give him this one because it's got strength up on it. Give him some queases. And then the, the sabatons can probably go. Topple resist, not particularly useful. Agility up might be good, but it's not as... Yeah. Alright, it's kind of hard to deck him out because I put so much uh, unique stuff on him. But uh, we'll see what I can do. Um... It's like an aggro up somewhere around here, right? Where is my aggro up? Now, oh, I have to put it on attack? Oh. Alright, what else can I give him? Um, muscle up? Muscle up works for me. Alright, he, he's solid. Alright, that, that's good enough for now. That's going to be my party, at least for a little bit here. Uh, let's head out. Let's actually fight something. That'd be nice. Um, I have to think where everything is. Satoru Marsh. Yes. It's been so long. Um, right, we want to go here. Glowing Obelisk. I don't remember any of these names anymore. I've been grinding on particular parts of the game for so long that none of this makes sense to me anymore. All right. Um... Only at, well, yeah, we want to change it to night because that's when all our buffs are. Uh, plus, I think there's a higher chance of him showing up at that point. 